Joshua Iniezo, also known as Solid Star, a Nigerian Afropop singer and songwriter, has been in the news lately for not so good reason. His younger brother recently came to reveal his mental health issues and solicited for support from fans, friends and celebrities alike. Just after his revelation, videos of him surfaced online walking barefooted and behaving erratically in public. But before we go further, let's remind you who Solid Star really is. His full name is Joshua Iniezo, born on 8th of November 1988, better known by his stage name Solid Star Isoko or simply Solid Star. He began his musical career as a drummer for a local church in his hometown of Delta State. Solid Star is popularly known across Nigeria and Africa for his hit song One in a Million. He got signed by OC Achievers. In 2010, he released his debut album One in a Million which went on to become a huge hit. The remix of the single One in a Million, he went further to feature Africa's legend Two-Face Idibia in that hit single One in a Million. He has followed up this feat with several hit singles later on down the line like Silicon featuring Timaya, International Woman, Mwa Baby featuring Tubaba, Wait Refix featuring Pataranking and Tiwa Savage, Wait featuring Davido, My Body featuring Timaya, Negotiate, Oluchi featuring Flavor and several other singles. Solisa is known for his ability to sing fluently in English, Isoko Anibo. He was born in Delta State, Nigeria to Mr. and Mrs. Inieso. His family originated from Aviara town. Solista began his music career at the age of 14 when he started playing the drums for his church choir in Aviara. He was discovered a few years later at a music talent show in Ajegunle area of Lagos State where he was introduced to Paul Cole, a record label boss in 2010. Solid Star formally signed to Achievers record and his debut album was subsequently released under the label. He has also won notable awards. In 2010, he won the Best New Artist for One in a Million at the Nigeria Music Video Award NMVA. He also won in 2015 the Best Reggae Dancehall Single for the Headies for My Body featuring Timaya. So recently, Solid Star's brother went online to reveal the singer's mental health. His concerned brother revealed that they have been attempting to control the ace artist's mental illness for some time, but he does not appear to welcome any improvements. After the announcement, the singer was seen walking around the streets barefoot and behaving erratically. This sends shockwave to the Nigerian entertainment scene. It does look like the 34-year-old is in some big trouble. Watch what the brother said to the public. Hello everyone, my name is Joseph Iniezo. I am Solid Star's brother. I want to use this medium to let his fans, his friends and his colleagues to know that Solid Star is really sick. I know you guys may be wondering why he has not been active all this while. Because he has been sick and battling a lot mentally. I know he must have offended some of his colleagues and friends, but please, it is not his fault. He has been really, really sick. We thought we could be able to sort the issue internally, and we tried our best. But please, we need your help now. His friends, his colleagues, please, we need your help. If there is any time in the world when he needs your help, it is now. Thank you all for listening. And I hope to hear from you guys. May God bless you all. These are also videos of him that also showed up online, roaming the street and screaming. There have been several reactions about this latest development by the emergency crooner. While some people used the opportunity to ask the Nigerian youth stay away from drugs, some others asked for support by well-meaning celebrities and Nigerians to come to his aid. One, the men's collection says, but Solid Star normally revealed in an interview that he was struggling with addiction. Probably she is getting worse. At Peps Vani said, it's drugs, he will be fine. He just needs some time alone and far from drugs. Blog by Mo wrote, say no to drug in Anodi here. Idex Osas says, stay away from drugs with the sad emoji. 
At Source MG commented, I don't think people understand when someone is battling with mental illness. I have someone like that. The family tried in everything. They locked him up. They even took him to rehab. He got back and shit got worse. So he ran away from home. So please don't blame the family. The family might be trying their best. Like she, they will not lock him up for the rest of his life, Nee? He asked. Cooley Graham added, being a celebrity doesn't stop one from experiencing the normal life problems. I pray that he finds whatever will give him peace once again. MC Reborn reacted thus, say no to hard drugs. In 2019, Solid Star narrated how he had the opportunity of a second chance after surviving the horrible aftermath of drug abuse. He claimed to have discovered through the experience that there is a thin line between life and death, he told a news media. Solid Star further warned his followers against doing drugs but added that those who find it hard to withdraw totally from drugs should switch smoking off only in their hemp. Oh well, which might not be the best thing though. The best, of course, is staying away completely. In any case, Solid Star is one artist that hasn't also been away from controversies. We've had several Nigerian artists who have had issues with their record label or their bosses. We know Two Face had an issue with his boss at some point. Um, we know Keys Daniel had an issue with his boss at some point. Whiskey also had issues with his boss at some point, so they had to part company and they mostly on their own. So Solid Star can be listed among those Nigerian celebrities or Nigerian artists who had issues with a record label and the reasons why he parted company with the record label. He had called out his former boss, Paul Cole Chiori, a Nigerian media entrepreneur, a music executive, also known as OC Achievers, who is accused of always wanting to see him sad. Solid Star in his Instagram post stated that he has been good to his former boss and family, even though he always wanted to see him sad. He added that the tables would turn at the end. OC Achievers, who fired back at Solid Star, alleged that the singer did not generate 10% of the 100 million naira he invested in his career in the 10 years they worked together. He also disclosed that the singer is owing him even though they parted ways peacefully in 2017. Solid Star's former label boss wrote, Mr. Joshua Inez or Solid Star, I know you missed me so much. My Midas touch on your career discovered you in 2007 and you lived with me for two years without a contract. Your welfare was my responsibility. In 2009, you signed your first pro contract. In 2014, you signed another contract that expired in 2017. We parted ways peacefully. Now let's figure out who is owing the other. I invested over 100 million in 10 years and your whole bookings for 10 years didn't generate 10% of the invested amount. The car you got from Achievers on higher purchase for 15 million, we deducted a little above 2 million and I learned you've sold the car without completing payment. It's a criminal offense and we can decide to take actions. You are like a house I built and I won't want to bring it down, but threats to my life I won't take lightly. Any more pim, I go change him. Please, if you love him and you are close to him, watch him closely. I think he is suffering serious depression and amnesia of the brain. This was way back in 2017. Solista, who reacted to OC Achievers post, accused him of seeking for fake sympathy after he demanded for his royalties from 2008 to 2018. He says, quote, OC, I simply requested for my royalties from 2008 to 2018 and you are using it as an avenue to seek for fake sympathy. Give me a sec. He went further to make another post with a caption that reads, Too much talk, no the full basket. You alone allow me for my kaluba at OC Achievers. So this was the last that was heard about the conversation between the record label boss and of course Solid Star. Whether it has anything to do with current situation of the guy is still left to be determined. But what we are saying clearly is that Solid Star is in big trouble as has been revealed by his brother and several persons have been putting across words and also comforting the family, giving suggestions as to what to do. Some other persons as well have been sending in monies because we have it on good authorities. There are a few celebrities 
that have sent in not just their love and their words of encouragement, but have some, I also have sent in some money. So whatever you can do as a person, as an organization, or even as a group, just to save a dear friend and an Afro pop entertainer, the one and only Solid Star. Thanks for watching your entertainment trends today. See you next time. Would you please come back? Mama won't need a million There is nothing I can do without you, baby Mama won't need a million